Hey everybody, welcome back to Big Red EDC. Well, we're taking a look at another flashlight from Through Night. This is the TH20 Pro. Now, obviously, you can see that it is a headlamp going on there. You've got your stretchy, stretchy going on there. But yeah, it is a pretty cool little light. Overall, 90 degree light. I like that. But obviously, that's going to work into the headlamp configuration now before we get too deep in it i will tell you it does come with pocket clip and i used it mainly in the headlamp mode i, I did kind of test out the pocket clip of course you get your battery charging cable and you get some extra o-rings but you've got this pretty cool little light here now i want to show you with that pocket clip you can either clip it on each end i did find it fit here it fit here um, you'll notice that when I did take the pocket clip off, uh, we did remove some of that coating. It kind of popped off and scratched it, but yeah, uh, it will go either way. It worked out pretty well. And, you know, like I said, though, I used it pretty much in this, conf in the headlamp configuration. Just wanted to test it out. But there you go. It does come with its own battery. 14500, 3.7 volt. You do have to remove the flashlight to charge, but it is USB-C type charging. Uh, pretty much standard construction. You do have your aluminum body. And I, oh, there we go. Got it started. But I, loot, I do like these little 90 degree flashlights, even if they're not in a headlamp configuration. But as you can see there, you do have your top switch. So when it's on your head, like so, either like that or like that however you choose to wear it probably whether you're right-handed or left-handed uh, you can operate the switch fairly easy pretty standard operator interface uh, first off you're going to press and hold that's going to give you what they call the firefly mode the firefly mode is just over half a lumen they've got it rated at 0.57 one click to shut off now to turn it on just press and there you go you get low mode at 46 lumens, press and hold. Jumps up to medium at 120 lumens. High gives you 406. Press and hold again, and you go back down to low. Shut it off. Double click. That's where you're going to get your power out of the turbo. That's 1010. 1010 lumens. And it says that's going to run for two minutes, and then it kicks down to 320 lumens. So kind of doesn't kick down to high, it kicks down to a little bit below high. And not only that, but triple click and you go into SOS mode. So pretty simple operator interface. We're going to pull it out of the headlamp configuration so we can do a little measuring. But there you go. That's what it looks like outside and i mean it does make a pretty handy little light like so you put the pocket clip on put it up here you could clip it you know on a you could clip it on a pack you could clip it on your pocket anything like that stand it up and shine the light out in front of you because well with that 90 degree head it makes it pretty easy to do so and like i said when it's in that configuration your button's right there on top easy easy to actuate got some good knurling and stuff going on as you can see, I did take a little bit of the coating off with that pocket clip, but had to try it out. You know what I mean? But all right, let's see what do we got here as far as specs. So we are looking at it is just over three inches long. We'll call it three and an eighth just because um, as far as overall width, you're looking at its widest point there at the bezel probably about three quarters just a little bit it's a light little light little light light little light doesn't weigh a whole lot how's that grams 54 and ounces 1.9 so just under two ounces i mean in this configuration i mean it's pretty easy it's easy enough to operate operator interface no issue with that whatsoever it's not a bad little light but let's go outside it's back deck time 
let's go play around. Before I do that, though, I'll throw out a couple more. It says it's good up to 141 lumens. It's got an impact resistance of 1.5 meters, and it is waterproof down to 2 meters, IPX8. So let's, uh, yeah, let's go outside. Let's check it out. All right, guys, we're outside. Frogs are chirping for you. Now, there you go. That's firefly mode. I mean, we're talking half, half a lumen. I mean, we're not seeing the ground pretty much at all. Now, the one thing I forgot to mention, in firefly mode, if you press and hold, it doesn't cycle through. You have to shut it off, turn it back on to get to low. Now, there you go. There's low. We got 46 lumens. Medium. We're talking... What was that, 120? It's pretty beam-centric. Cycle up. There is 4, 405? A little over 400. Yeah, 405, I believe. So, very beam-centric. Not a lot of flood. Um, it's a wider beam. But definitely, definitely beam-centric. Do we have any visitors tonight? No, not that I can tell. Does not look like we have any visitors this evening. All right, we're going to double click. That is 1,010 lumens. Lighten up that pretty big. And like I said, we still don't have... We're going to call this a wide beam. You know, it's not a lot of flood, as you can see there. I mean, we do have some re residual light going on tonight. It's not even fully dark, I don't think. And I didn't turn the light off to the room to make it completely dark but oh well so now it did said it it did say it would kick down after two minutes so i'm kind of leaving it up here i'm gonna feel that no it's not getting overly hot at a thousand lumens so that's good i'm just kind of waiting for it to kick down we're gonna look around see if we can find with a thousand lumens See if we can find any visitors. Turn it off. Turn it back on. Now there is, it came back on in low. There's 46. Cycle back up to medium. There we can just, we can just make out the corner down there. Cycle back up. There's high again right there and then of course back up to turbo so there you go guys that's kind of what it looks like how it operates let's get back upstairs and we'll close this thing out so there you go guys a little bit of a shot on how it looks the beam you're going to get out of it like i said it's kind of a wider beam but not a lot of flood so that's all right uh you know I have had the comments before if, you know, hey, if I want a headlight, I should probably just buy a headlamp. And absolutely, you could definitely do that. Of course, something like this configuration gives you a little bit more versatility with that pocket clip. But if you don't need the versatility, I totally get that. But now, the nice thing about this light, it's only $24.99 on Amazon. That's a really, really good price. For this little light. Not to mention, I looked right before uh, starting this video, and it also has a 15% off coupon. So you're gonna get this thing for pretty close. You know, what's that? 243 bucks. You get about three bucks off. So you're looking at almost $20 for this little light. Of course, there's shipping and all that good stuff, but or tax, depending on where you live love Washington and their tax, but, you know, for less than $25, it's a pretty, pretty good little pickup, in my opinion. Good little light. You get plenty of light out of it. Thousand lumens. I had no issues. We did uh, some work with it a couple of nights ago. Uh, we're working outside. That's when I used it, and, you know, it worked out pretty good. Strapped it to my hard hat. No issues whatsoever. Now, you know, there is this cover, you know, um, or the cor the 
strap. That's the word I'm looking for. The strap and stuff, you know, when you're not using it, yeah, you can kind of bunch it up. If you got it, you got yourself a rubber band or something handy, that'd probably be a good way to store it. Um, I don't re recommend hanging it by the strap because that will eventually stretch it out if you leave it sitting up there for a long time. I did have a headlamp that I did that too, and uh, yeah, it's stretched out. <laughs> it's pretty, it's elasticity is pretty much gone, but you know, shout out to Through Night. Really appreciate them sending out the TH20 Pro to check out. Not a bad little headlamp. Kind of a dual purpose, dual action flashlight. Throw that pocket clip on there. And you got yourself a pretty cool 90 degree light. So really appreciate, like I said, Through Night sending it out. And I really appreciate you guys stopping by and checking it out with me today. As always, thank you so much. Like, subscribe. Leave me that comment. You know I love talking to you. Until next time, guys. I'll talk to y'all later. Bye-bye.